<laughs> well, there's nothing more must else to say, is there? <laughs> is that this it, isn't it? Wow, that was G all the way through. Power I know, I was through. thinking like I'm just staying on the G. Stay on the G. Um, so welcome back to Anderson TV. I'm Pete. And it's the beautiful Rabir. I'm Rabir. So sweaty Rabir. I always sweaty. Um, uh, you've seen us do videos on the Hanson guitars before. Uh, Anderson sells these exclusively in the UK, so and we are very proud of these guitars because they're super cool. Danish made, handmade guitars. Um, super top specs, mahogany, f rosewood boards, but uh, these nuts of uh, moose bone from Norway, they take and find them and they dig them down into somewhere. And, wow. But if you want to watch the full videos we've done, there will be some more up here. So we just wanted to say that this is the serial number 500 uh, of the Hanson guitars and they're very, very proud of that and um, they should be because they make some amazing guitars, amazing value for money, um, all handmade in Denmark, of course, all with great sp um, sp yeah, but to be fair, like you're holding it thinking, well, this could be any, it could, yeah, like it multiple could be thousand like that, yeah. pound, like, strap. and they are less money than that, you know. And yeah. they're super lightweight. All of the guitars are lightweight. Um, this is a gold one we've got in just at the moment. There's this is four hundred eighty nine. Yeah, and this is serial number five hundred. So I just thought we'll do a little comment. What is it called? Com commentary. What is it called? Commemorative. Commemorative. That's See? the word. That's the word. I wouldn't know. None of us can yeah. find it. It's like <laughs> we have to get somebody who's actually gone to school and, uh, yeah. to tell us that. But there's not much else to say than what you heard in the beginning. Uh, if you're looking for something that is. Uh, a great alternative to a Strat or a Fender or anything that is, you know, Hanson is just the way to go. They really, really, really I do. I love the little bottle thing that they put on their guitars. Yeah. Every Hanson guitar has the bottle mark. Yeah. So the two ball go Carlsberg and they, they bang it down there. And the relicking is really done really, really well. It's done you know? honestly, which yeah. is what I like, is it's not trying to, it's not unrealistic, you know. And no. like, being relic connoisseurs <laughs> or at least i really enjoy a good relic job yeah. and i would say that <laughs> they do a good job here too yeah sometimes you can get carried away but i feel like with yeah. this it's honestly done it's like yeah this has been used for you know a couple of decades yeah. not like ridiculously but it's like had it's it's had it had a good time out on stage yeah and, and i'll tell you what they do as well so it's interrupted but they do little relic in, in the neck as well well yeah and, and it's where it's like that's what's going to happen yeah. If you've got a guitar and you have it on the stage, you knock it over, whatever, you'll have some battle scars on the neck as well. And it's just, it's just, they, they feel nice. The necks are, um, I think they're 10-inch radius, so they're quite, not flat, but 10 or 12, I can't remember, the links are below. Uh, this one, because it's a special one, it's got a bind, uh, bound neck as well on it. Um, it was bound to happen at some point. It feels, like a, <laughs> it feels like you're early to mid-60s. Yeah, it's a slim profile. Yeah, it's nice and slim, super comfortable to play. Mm. It's German steel frets on here. Uh, st German st silver, German silver frets on here. That's what I was going to say. They look similar to the ones that you like, the sixty yeah, so I think one or fives or whatever. Tall and narrow, yeah. yeah. But these are German silver. I don't know what that means other than it's silver and it's German. Oh, silver, German, wow. silver. That's what it is. It's Would not. You... It's not nickel or anything. It's German silver. Would you look at that? Will you look at that? Should we do tones? Yeah. Okay, so let's do tones. I'll do quick tones on this into the DP40. As you could hear in the beginning, I was using the tone control. I do that a lot with my, uh, my, my telecasters because I can kind of control the... Take off just uh. the tip of it. You get lots of If you don't want to overpower the other player. <laughs> it meant to be a minor, that's sorry. Middle position. Here's an origin effect. So there's a lot in the tone controls. That's I like doing that with my. I like to do that with my tellies. Here's uh, the Dane, which we know works really well with the telecast. Mm -hmm. 
All the same legs all the time. Yeah, that sounds Middle awesome. Middle In my awesome. opinion, in my opinion, these guitars are so difficult to beat because they are they got time with them. They yeah. don't make a ton of them. Mm. They just make one at a time and they just go, here you go. And then it, <laughs> yeah. But that's what it's always like. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Come with the cases and everything. And this is serial number 500. It sounds cool. And it sounds great. It's so nice to play, man. Mm. And I love that it, the that it's mahogany body because you get that that sustain. <laughs> So anyway, so I, I'm, it's great. I would highly and hard, warm and heartedly, <laughs> whatever it is, I would recommend these guitars all day long. I really would. I really would. Yeah, man. Links are below for that. Let's have a listen to your Goldie over there. That's mine's great, mine's a Goldilocks. Very much a, <laughs> very much a sort of Strat style guitar, of course. Three single coils. Do you know what pickups they are specifically? I had, they, they make their, make own, their pickups, own pickups. Yeah. Right. Yeah. In, It'll be the links below. Yeah. Okay. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm running the. Uh, one f I'm running the Kraken now. Yeah. Uh, on a low gain, we're going to use a little bit of reverb and delay. Start on the neck. Can we do the uh, slow dancing test? Of course. We need the. Can it do? Can it do the slow dancing test? <laughs> Let's see if it does the slow dancing test. Give me one sec. Give me one. Needs to be on the right sound. I mean, that is the Kraken trying to do that, but it That's works. It. Basically, it's a great feeling, great sounding guitar. Let's swap over and say thank you very much for watching. Uh, links are below for more Hanson guitars. They come and go. Uh, you can call up and, and spec something if you want, but it's just, I mean... Solid. We keep, they keep coming in once in a while and we keep adding them to the, to the stock and they keep going pretty quick, so uh, be quick. What that means? It's that double thing. Okay. Have a quickie. I'm, I'm rambling on. Let's swap over. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. <laughs> Bye. Link below. <laughs>